all right, because I mean, Balrog Rufus is def traditionally a at least a 5-5. Five five. A lot of Rufus players believe that Balrog has the advantage, and a lot of Balrog players feel that too, but I think once it gets started, kind of close range game, 5-5. Uh, five five. Don't know if this is going straight into the game or a button check, but two characters that are obviously going to be played. Yes, they're not even they're not even front if it's a button check. They're just oh, like, yeah, okay. eh, whatever. You already know what I'm doing. Yep. Uh, and we're live. Balrog versus Rufus. Classic as far as Street Fighter IV goes. Close. So I'm playing against the First hit from Balrog. Second as well. No, Rufus. Switches sides. A little bit dicey, but yeah, power bit. over the pressure. Fishing at the mid range, a lot of sweeps, long range pokes. Rufus trying to find his way in. Aware of uh, the pace that he kind of needs to take it at. I like the whiff back kick low. Oh, no reaction. Uh, neutral yes. jump on those. There it is. Ah, neutral ball. Gets the sweep in. But that's that strong, NorCal. Oh! Ultra? Rufus definitely one of the characters you just spend it. Did you get it? Oh, goes for a setup that does not work because Balrog is funny. Great patience on that headbutt. Crack Fiend looking to close it out. Nice. Just low jab. I think what? EX Messiah, you'd be safe. Ixmasai definitely would have blown that up. However, it's you could time it's worth it. Yeah, I mean minimal damage. It's it's fast enough. Two point three frame, probably two point five. But who's counting? The recovery that's so fast. Yeah. Oh. Oh, gets with the Goes overhead. Goes for the block. Oh, that's and there's a crossover. Forward throw from Rufus. Setups. Stays in front. Oh wow, and Brent turning it on. Neutral jump, kick him to the wall. What? I don't know, he put his super, it could, could have been missed, missed input. I don't think he was gonna super there, but like, oh, even if, oh, he didn't have ultra, so I don't know. Maybe that's supposed to work? Oh, that's, wow. yeah. Jam ultra? No. That's, that's hard, that's actually a relatively tight link. I, I don't think it's, it's, it might be one frame, but it's also, it's probably a bit closer to two. Really? Wave so. I mean, there's a weird like I don't know way about going going about it, right? You have to start with one of the versions of the ultra and then switch to punches. Well, it's a it's definitely a link. There's not actually a cancel on it. Okay. Yeah, see, I like wow. that a lot more. Instead of trying to block the follow up from the side kick, do something. And in the case of the overhead, he got under and got the punch. Wow, nice big roundhouse to sweep. Tried to do the same. Oh, the that was a big mistake. Red focus, all his meters gone. Yeah. Oh god, Brent in. Oh, that's what that's what the follow-up was before. Yep. Yeah. Wow. Okay, Brent. Bring the back strong. Take the first game. And looks like Crack Fiend is. Just pleased with his I, stick? Yep. Switch and sticks. It almost looked like he was just conceding. But nope, but... Oh, then he throws the stick on the chair. All right, grabbing the TE. It's it's hard. You take a, uh, <laughs> take a red focus that you didn't intend to do. That's... In a matchup that you know you yeah. feel confident in. Yeah, friends don't let friends buy combo. Grabbing that Mad Cat stick. Plugging it in. Tried and true. So getting back in for the second game. Crack Fiend. Still recovering. Looking down, shaking his head. Not pleased with how that turned out. No. No. A uh, bit, bit of an understatement there, but you drop a lot of stuff. Who will emerge a champion? Fight! So back to it. At the same time, Brent playing really great. Even oh, yeah. with that red focus being unintentional and all that, you know, Brent's Rufus on point. That that set or that that round that game. What am I trying to say? 
it seemed like a bit of a nervous start, but once you started going, you added up the cross-up dive kicks, changing up charge times, um, and Crackney just not challenging where he should have. So uh, I especially like to see after the Messiah kick, just do something, because otherwise Rufus is going to be... You go for a big combo, or you can just make sure that Rufus doesn't do that and has to waste the bar to get out of that situation. Right. Oh, focus from Paul Rufus. Twirling in. Ah, crack bean. Yep. Changing up air his to stick. air makes makes a difference. I think air to air is always super important against Rufus player. Just gotta keep him honest. Was that a that was a confirm off of? Uh oh. Again. Yeah. At least he got a bit more out of it. Three more hits. Yeah, no, but that's that's solid damage. Yeah, huge corner carry. Well. That went pretty much wall to wall. Yep. What? Oh. Again with the big roundhouse mid screen into the sweep. Big confirm into the EX Galactic Tornado. Brent on point with that. Match point for him. Rufus is one of those characters. He can cover a lot of Balrog's escape options, which people have trouble with. Monkey steals Peach. Fishing with sweeps. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. A little low jab check. Wow, that's got on his face. Balrog. Stick to not doing much for you. Decking. Nothing. Push to the wall. Going for setup. Stay on the same side. Again, dive kick on his face. No confirm off of it. Balrog kind of just stuck. Getting pummeled this round. Gets a trade. Ultra. Need anything. Just like give me a fucking... A little bit of... A little bit of room, please. Takes him to the other wall. Back to the bow house. But full meter for Coco oh, Super. Something that Kraken was not utilizing was, was rough, but jump back jab is actually a really important tool in this matchup. It keeps, at bare minimum, you get Rufus off of you in a right. situation where he has nothing but dive kick pressure or dive kick whip and a throw or. Something.